reason why they beat us. You know? so tonight, we just tried to keep them off the glass. Not to let them get any easy buckets like that. Were you amazed at that sequence by Kyle when you guys were kind of struggling a little bit? They cut it to 10. He blocks Jennings twice and then he runs down the floor for the layup. Yeah, you know, that's, that, was, that was a great little uh, sequence for Kyle. You know, he's a, he can consistently do that. You know, it's, it's like great to watch. You know, it gets everybody excited, you know, him blocking shots like that. So hopefully, uh, we continue that. I mean, again, not to pound it in the ground, but that second unit again yeah, provided a nice lift. You guys, uh, uh, nice punch off the bench against the uh, Yeah, you know, we, uh, we went out there, like I said, we, we just go in there and play together, play, play for each other, you know, we cut each other's backs. And uh, we really try to run with that unit in there because, you know, the Victor pushing the ball and, uh, you know, me and Thrawn are in the wings and Thrawn spotting up and we uh, just. Just but you, you knocked down a couple of threes, but uh, you feel comfortable driving baseline, but you have another one, a little floater in the window. But with that team with that size, I don't know if it's that size, but you look very comfortable up there offensively. Oh, yeah, you know, just trying to be aggressive, you know, attack, you know, have, you know, have opportunities, and, you know, today I was just making, making some shots. Derek was saying that Josh was one of the toughest guards in the league, and Tobias got in a little foul trouble, and he went to you at the four. What you know, was your game plan against a guy like Josh? Just to, uh, really just not to let him get to the basket. You know, we want him to shoot a jump shot, you know, that's, uh, that's what we'll, we'll take that, you know, if he makes it, he makes it, but that's, we'd rather him doing that than getting to the basket every time, just uh, not letting him get in the post, just uh, try to keep him off the glass. What about their starters in there for the whole fourth quarter, and Jock had a choice, he kept you guys in there. I mean, it just it just shows that he trusts us. You know, he didn't uh, he didn't just jump to take us all out, put the starters back in. He uh, let us finish the game, and you know that, that that's important for us. You know, just to, just to know that he trusts us. You know, it gives us kind of more freedom to just go out there and play and not be so worried about making mistakes. You guys kind of look to Kyle to, to lead that group from a vocal standpoint. I know that he's talking up there. Do you guys look to him for a little bit of leadership out there? Too? Sometimes, you know, Kyle, he's, he's, he's talking a lot. Of <laughs> a lot of times he's, he's confused, too. So, we're, we're <laughs> so we, we, like I said, tune some of it up, I guess. Yeah. So we, we just help each other, you know. Uh, we try to pick each other up. If somebody makes a mistake, we try to just keep playing and pick each other up. And, um, I think we do a great job. Of uh, yeah, you know, just try to build up the positivity. We can stop. We're not getting easy layup. Um, this, we can just keep. Hopefully, we can just keep building up this into the next game. How can you tell when he's confused? Huh? How can you tell when he's confused? <laughs> the look on his face. <laughs> <laughs> Not so much what comes out of his mouth. No, just the look on his face. Yeah. Well, Jack, Jack said before the season, the main point of emphasis was to play better at home, to learn how to defend the home court. You guys, 11 of your 14 wins have come at home. You won four out of five here. Talk about what the, the, the game plan playing at home. Uh, I mean, it's, it's pretty much just to protect, the, protect our floor, you know. Um, we, we struggled a bit, we were struggling a bit on the road, but you know, when we come home, we kind of have the fans behind us. We just, we just try to protect home and play for, try to get some wins for the fans. You're in a stretch now where you played Paul George the other night, you had Josh tonight, you got KD coming up, Paul George again. I mean, those are your kind of matchups, right? Do you get fired up to play those, to face those kind of guys? Uh, yeah, you know, anybody who I'm playing against, I'm trying to shut it down. You know, and, uh, you know, we got KD coming on, on Friday. You know, he's, a, he's been playing, he's been playing great. You know, so just got to try to slow him down. Two of your best games last season were against Oklahoma City. I mean, you, you had, I think, five or six blocks, five steals against them. What did, what did you learn having to guard a guy like that? In your uh, you know that. I mean, you're not going to stop. Or shut them down. You know what I'm saying. You can the best you can do is try to slow it down, slow him down, and make it tough for him. And just try to just be in him. You know, he's, like I said, he's been playing great, so it's going to be a, it's going to be tough. But I think we are. I'm up for it. I'm ready for it. Okay. All right, so I gotta ask, what, what is the deal with those shoes? <laughs> <laughs> I can't take my eyes off. No. So, uh, 